Hey everyone, Sergey here from uchromedia.com and let me show you how to use this motion graphic template for Blender. So the first thing you wanna do, obviously download it, double click, open it up in Blender and we're gonna change the text first. So we're gonna select this text, press tab on your keyboard to go into edit mode, control A to select everything and then we're gonna type something like Blender. Once you're done, press tab again to get out of edit mode into object mode. And then we're gonna adjust this animated line. As you can see, it kind of animates all the way through, but you want it to be the same length as your text. So you wanna select this, press tab to go into edit mode. And it's a curve, or what we call in Cinema 4D, spline. So we have two points. We have one point and then two points. So you just wanna make sure that this one kinda of lines up with this text. So you wanna kinda of drag it out to the beginning of it. And then the same thing for that one, kind of drag it out. And again, if you're not seeing the move tool, just press T on your keyboard and you'll see this toolbar pop up and that's the move tool. All right, so once you are done, press tab to get out of edit mode into object mode. So now we are in object mode. And next what we wanna do, we wanna change some colors, some materials. And the way it works is pretty simple. So if you wanna change this blue, you just select it and then go into this material tab and in here, as you can see, we have it in there, selected. And the way it works is just one material kind of used globally. So when you change this blue, it would also change that one and that one as well. So when you go to color and change it to something like, mm, let's do something like red maybe, or maybe green. Again, as you can see, I changed this one, that one is changed and so is this one. So it applies it globally. And then if you wanna change this red, you select it and uh, let's do something bright like blue. As you can see, that one changed and so did this line, I believe. Let's try, yep. And the last thing we wanna do, we wanna change the last color, which is this one right here, the light blue. So select it and change it to something like yellow. No, let's do something bright red or orange. Orange is good. So after that, after we made all these changes, you can also do white. You can select this white. As you can see, we have main color right here. Change it to something like maybe yellow. And instantly we've created something different. As you can see, all the colors are updated. And now we can hit render. And to do that, it's pretty simple. Make sure you go to output tab in here. Make sure everything's correct, your path, the file format. And once you're done, just go to render and then click on render animation. And that is it. Again, thank you so much for downloading this template. And until next time, my name is Sergey Praknevsky, and this is ukramedia.com.